When water is added to soil, the water we add has to pass through in-between gaps or channels in the soil particles. The speed at which water flows through the column of soil is known as percolation rate and percolation of water depends on the particle size of the given soil sample. Let us see, for this we need three funnels having a cotton plug at the end, conical flasks, 20 grams each of sand, loamy soil, clay and three beakers with 50 milliliters of colored water. Put the sand in the first funnel, loamy soil in the second and clay in the third. Now pour the colored water slowly over each type of soil. Observe the amount of water percolated. After some time, Pour out the water which seeps through the funnel. You see sand has the highest percolation rate while clay did not percolate any water. So clay has the highest retention capacity. If we observe the particle sizes of these samples, we see that the particle size of sand is biggest followed by that of loam and clay has the smallest size. So percolation rate through a column of soil is directly proportional to the size of the particles. A soil is a mixture of particles of different sizes. Collect three different samples of soil from three different places and compare percolation rate of water through them.